Well, it's crazy to think that it's already that time, but today some students headed back to school here in western New York. We're learning about what's new at the Charter School for Applied Technologies in Buffalo. News 4's Angela Cristoforo shows us what parents and students can expect. More than 500 middle school students are back to school here at the Charter School for Applied Technologies Middle School, where there are a lot of new things like renovated classrooms and new school administration. Our kids will be provided a lot of hands-on experience, and so we're going to, that's going to be our foundation of what we do and offer our students here at CSET. Through a program called Project Lead the Way, there's a big focus on STEM learning, which stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. We really work to integrate that into everything, and we have uh, wonderful programs for that. All of our students K-8 have their own laptop uh, to work on. There are three schools within the Charter School for Applied Technologies, the elementary, middle, and high school. And even the youngest students in kindergarten are getting hands-on experience with STEM. Our kindergartners are doing some really basic coding with um, arrows, so they're not actually using like word coding or JavaScript, but they're actually coding like a small animal to move through a maze using a series of arrows. Though there is an emphasis on technology, you'll also find traditional classes too. You're not coming in and just learning about engineering, just learning about computers. You're coming in, you're learning about art, you're learning about music, you're learning about the business world. There's also a therapy dog in each school, like this chocolate lab named Bear. Some students that are struggling during the day may need a little extra support or calming environment, and they'll come and, and sit with one of our dogs, pet them. For more information about Project Lead the Way and the Charter School for Applied Technologies, head to our website, WIBB.com, for a link. In Buffalo, Angela Cristoforos, News 4.